All right, I decided to make this quick video series. It's probably going to be like three total videos. One's going to be this one, which is the intro and installation of Auto Fence Builder. Uh, I'll probably have another one on how to learn it and go in and the best way to explore it, because I think that's the best way to learn it. And then I probably do one last video uh, with an example. So Auto Fence Builder, to me, is one of the, after VS Pro and RAM, is probably the best asset you can buy. But if you're not building any fences or you don't need fences, then it <laughs> doesn't do you any good. Um, installation is rather simple, but I'll just run it through. Uh, through with you guys really quick. Obviously, you're going to go into the asset store. Um, you're going to do a search for auto fence builder. I don't think there's any other version than um, than the one that we can use. Uh, let me see here. Auto fence and wall builder. Here it is. 40 bucks. Um, like always, though, just make sure that the, the your our version is listed. If I do a filter here. If I do 20, yeah, that's listed in here. This is it. So you're going to purchase it, um, download it, and then install it. Okay. Now, after you install it, it doesn't look like it did anything, but it's in there. All you have to do is you come up here to component, I'm sorry, game object, and you say create auto fence builder. You click that uh, option right there. And then when you do it, you're going to get this add on into your scene called auto fence builder. And at that point, you have Auto Fence Builder installed, and you are ready to rock and roll.